a super cool party people i am making sure to start the vlog this morning because i have no idea what happened yesterday morning it is currently quarter to seven i'm just waiting for my vlog to do its thing and export and then i can get it up and let me tell you i was tired yesterday i am just as tired today i actually have written down on my notes to do list that's the word to do list today to have a nap because i think it might be needed and good news, I'm off tomorrow, but then I work two more days to round out my seven of eight in a row. <laughs> but I'll probably survive. And then I have two days off, I work one, and then I have a bunch of days off, which I need to look at because, ah, there's so much stuff to do. But I am just slowly puttering. It's a slow wake-up morning. This morning, I snoozed until 6.10. Wow, my brain is like actually stopping as I'm trying to use it. It's like, <laughs> like, you know, trying to turn a car over. That's the sound of a car turning over in my head. Anyway, I think I'm just going to try to be pretty chill this morning. Have my breakfast drink here. Uh, watch some YouTube. I don't think I'm going to like, I, I'm not, I'm not making my bed. I've said that before and then made it, but I don't plan on it this morning. So that's where we're at. And um, yeah, welcome. <laughs> Alrighty, as promised, I have not made my bed and it's not happening, but I did try out my new foundation and I kind of really like it. It's a pretty good match for my skin, so good job me, because I was like, eh, this seems about right. And also it, compared to my BB cream that I've been using, which is like sheer coverage, this actually has coverage to the point that I almost forgot concealer because I was like, wow, this looks good. So I'm sorry I'm looking at myself, but... I'm pretty impressed with it. It feels kind of weird to be wearing this much makeup because I don't usually as much as you might not think because <laughs> my foundation is usually so sheer so I usually feels like I have no makeup on but yeah not bad and we went too hard on the highlighter. We know this is a problem. Anyway it is about quarter after seven. The vlog is uploading. I am watching some Sophia Nygaard because she's good. <laughs> And I'm gonna get dressed here in a second, but I want to share the embroidery piece I'm working on. So this is the first time I've like filled anything in and haven't hated it. So yay! So working on that, hopefully get that finished soon. But yeah, I'm gonna get dressed now because the clock is ticking. I mean, it's still like half an hour before I need to leave, but I'm gonna take my time. I know I've already said that I want a nap, but I definitely want a nap. Also, that fridge is really loud. Anyway, I've arrived at work. I'm still trying to figure out lighting too much too much <laughs> i was like i'll turn on the concession lights and then everything will be better but really it is not so let's tromp over here to slightly better lighting hopefully <laughs> what is my life better all right i am here i don't think it should be too long of a day today which is nice especially considering when i walked in i was like wait why am i here today that happens sometimes sometimes when i've been here a lot i'm like i don't even know also i'm hopefully going to put together a schedule for everything that i need to do next week so i know how many days i need to come in and work and if and when i need to bring extra people in so that is the plan but we'll get to that as the day goes on. Hopefully, like I said, it won't be a long day. I did a lot yesterday to kind of get caught up, so it should just be pretty chill. That's what I'm hoping for at least, and then I can go home and have a nap. Although in this particular moment, I am not super exhausted, but it comes and goes in waves, so we'll see. I should just, I should drink more caffeine in the morning. That may be the solution. It's a terrible idea. Anyway, just checking in and also thinking that like, maybe I'm just not gonna be productive at all today. Is that a thing I can do? I mean, like once I get home from work, like can I just choose to not do anything? <laughs> I know, like, logically i know yes yes i absolutely can choose to do nothing when i get home but my brain goes but you have this to do and this to do and this to do and this to do so we will see what happens when we get home but maybe i'll just do like the bare minimum maybe i'll just do my japanese study because that's a daily requirement and then just embroider for the rest of the day just have a nap do japanese and embroider that seems like an amazing idea. I'll have to look at my list when I get home to see what I actually need to do because I definitely know there are things I want to do, but we'll see. Alrighty, so it is pretty much two o'clock. I got off just before one and it took me about an hour to like 
eventually make my way home. <laughs> I am changed. I'm so comfy. I keep forgetting that I own this sweater. It is just so cute. It's got stars on it. It was a vibe I was going for when I went shopping and I got it. And I keep forgetting that I have it because I usually go into this side of the closet because that's where my long sleeves and my t-shirts and stuff are. But I classify this as a sweater so it's on that side of the closet so I usually don't open that door. And then it's sad and then I see it and when I'm like going to bed at night, I'm like, oh, rude. Anyway, I'm gonna make myself some lunch because I'm quite peckish and I'm just trying to decide what I want to do while I eat. The options are, or while I cook and eat, is the options are I could study some Japanese, get that out of the way, just use my flashcards because I'm getting into the um, hiragana that has like the extra accents and stuff on it to change like ka to ga and she to G and um, I'm not as well versed in some of those I'm realizing as I'm getting into it so that could be an excellent use of my time because it's gonna take me like half an hour to cook and then I'll eat and I can still keep studying or alternatively I'll just watch Survivor I think the new Survivor starts tonight too so I want to look into I was gonna purchase it on iTunes but then I was like maybe it'd be cheaper for me to just do CBS online which I had before but I found that it was just wasting all my time because I was just watching Survivor all the time. But really, I'm just, anytime I'm not working lately, I've kind of just been watching Survivor all the time. So I'm going to look into CBS online. I'm going to, I'm like, just look at the cost. Like, there's only so many episodes of Survivor in this season. So there's a good chance that I'll only have to pay for like two, maybe three months. I don't, yeah, pro three months, probably three months. And I, it was like $6 a month. So $18 is cheaper than like the 30 that I'd pay to buy it. So we'll think about it. It's actually funny because there's a lot of seasons that I recognize and I know who won that I'm like, why? It's because I had CVS online and I was just binge watching because I didn't buy I'm like, I don't own these. How do I know? But anyways, my battery's going to die. I'm going to die if I don't eat food. That's over dramatic. A little peter out. And then um, I'll get back in touch with you after. It's a weird way to say that. Alrighty, so it is currently three o'clock. That took forever. I cooked food. I ate food. I cleaned up after eating food. I did this. I also watched some YouTube videos because I was like, you know what? I just want to cram this food in my face and um, I can't really turn flashcards while I do that. But after I finished watching the video and eating, I sat down there and I did like another probably 20 minutes. So I probably did like 40 minutes today. So it's cool. Anyway, I clearly have a lot of energy. Can you tell? <laughs> um, so I'm going to make my bed because I don't think I'm going to nap today. So I might as well do that and I'll feel more put together and organized. And then I guess I'll take a look at my list, my to-do list and see what I want to do. There was something I was supposed to put on there. Do you guys remember what I said I was going to put on there? CBS Live. Thank you. <laughs> anyway, so I'm going to like get my butt in gear and get some of this stuff happening and then probably watch a little bit of Survivor and Embroider because my piece is coming along so well. I'm so happy because like, like I said last night, this is the first time that I've been filling something in and not hated it. I don't think... Yeah, the other one's under the bed. You know what? I'll show you. So there was this one that I thought was pretty okay, especially for my first attempt at French knots and also sand stitch, but... Did I throw it out? <laughs> oh, here it is. I tried to do this island, but I think I used too many strands of thread and didn't try to blend it, so it just looks like trash. So I hate it. Ah, pika! Anyway, so that's where we're at with some of my other projects, but so far this one's going really well. I think time will tell when I add the blue to the mountain to make it look like a mountain. It'll either go well or we'll be back to that island situation. Anyways, I'm gonna make my bed because I should really make my bed at some point. I just, I tossed, after I bought this, I tossed everything back in here because breaking off all the letters is such a pain. I should deal with that at some point, but, and like, just gotta pick up a little bit. It's not too messy in here. So that's what I'm gonna work on. I'm gonna put on Survivor, I think, while I do that. And then we'll go from there. This is so cute. OMG, I am loving it. The only thing, is obviously I'm getting better the more I do it. The like white up here could have been better, but oh, it's so cute. I love it. 
still watching Survivor. Alrighty, look at that, it's done. That says Japan, by the way. Um, I need to still go over it with heat to get rid of some of the lines, but I'm so happy with it. <gasps> Yay! <laughs> Anyways, it is currently quarter after six, so I think dinner is happening soon, so I'm gonna roll my way downstairs and um, do that, and then maybe, just maybe, when I'm finished dinner, I'm going to edit my book. I wasn't going to edit my book today, but you know what? We're good. I finished this, and I'm just really content. Like, this is so cool. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to go, and I'll check in with you after. Alrighty, I am struggling. I tried to write a blog post, but my brain just like did not work. I still posted it though, like maybe that wasn't the right call because like, I just, I could not, I could not figure it out. I couldn't, I was like, I, I don't even know if this makes sense. Posted it anyways though because I guess that's what we did. I just, I titled it Scrambled because I started with talking about how I was burnt out and how people I work with are burnt out and I think I ended it with Screw it, I'm not doing anything, <laughs> or something to that effect. Because that is my vibe right now. It is, screw it, I am not doing anything. So, it's just about eight, by the way. I'm gonna go take off my face. Which wore really well today. I had to retouch my nose earlier, but that was because I scratched my nose and I just straight up scratched all the foundation off. So yeah, this foundation's pretty nice. I don't mind it. I'm excited to try more of it. But I'm gonna go wash it off. Maybe I'm trying to decide what I want to do. Because it is just eight o'clock and that seems a little too early to go to sleep. But also I'm really tired. So Maybe I'll watch a movie, maybe I'll do a face mask. I'm not gonna do a face mask, who am I kidding? Maybe I'll maybe I'll put like my little under eye mask things I really like. I don't know, we'll see. I'm just gonna do and I'm gonna change my pajamas and then I will figure it out from there. <laughs> I'm losing it. Alrighty, so I have made it to 8.30, but I am I'm done now. I felt a little bit better when I washed my face and all that fun stuff, but <sighs> I'm not doing well in the realm of consciousness. So with that, I'm going to say thank you so much for coming along on today's adventure, and I will see you tomorrow when we do very similar things. Good night.